Okay, feed and edge your inner tubes. Um, feed and edge tyres are tricky things anyway. They do tend to fail if you're not careful. In fact, they just tend to fail anyway sometimes because it's an outdated technology. However, to try to diminish the risk of failure, fitting a good inner tube is one of the best things you can do. We say the Michelin tubes are the ones to go for. They're really heavily reinforced, get a lot of rubber people on it. Um, and they're extremely high quality, so we go Michelin every time. I I'm just demonstrating it, so I'm using one of my dad's wheels on this car, so I'm just going to stick the one back in. But we've got Michelin tubes on the shelf, let us know we'll post them out here. So, first of all, what you do with your tubes is just stick your inner tube inside the tyre. Um, you try not to get it creased in there, it should fit in reasonably well. Some, some inner tubes are a bit more difficult to get in without a crease than others. Um, and the technique to use with those is to put air in and out of the tube. Um, and if you, you know, if you put a bit of air in and then let it out again, then put a bit of air in again, then the tube, that might help you shuffle the inner tube into place to make sure it's sat in there comfortably without any creases. Okay, so the valve stems of these tubes, it's important to get this right. So your, your Michelin inner tube comes with this very short valve stem on there. So we just take that cap off there. And then you get, with that you get a little kit with the inner tube. So be careful not to lose these when we post it out to you. Don't lose these packets because we only get one with every inner tube. We can't get spare ones. So there's your valve stem, look, this is a short one which is designated for wire wheels and the like, so we put those on there and then you get a nut and a concave washer, okay? So what we do is we put the nut slightly up the base of the valve stem like that, screw that there a little bit, and then we put the valve, the, the washer on there, okay, and then all that screws onto the inner tube. Okay, and what we've got is we've got the, uh, it's just been awkward, we've got the, the concave side of the washer is against the inner tube, if you can see, okay. All of this is going to go inside the tyre. The plan is that the washer and the nut are there to stop the inner tube from blowing up around the valve stem in your rim. Just give me two ticks, I'm going to get a pair of players. It doesn't need to be mega tight, but just a little bit, just a little bit like that, does it not? And then simply do this nut down, so that nut pushes that concave washer against the inner tube. So the nut is against the convex side of the washer, the concave side of the washer is against the inner tube. And all that goes inside the tyre, inside the rim. So there you go, longstonetires.com for more information. The phone number is 01302 711123 um, for more information about tubes. But go for a mixture of the tube, they're superb.